Hey guys, it's your friend Izzy, and today I'm doing my June favorites for 2015, of course. I haven't made videos in a while, so yeah, sorry. So it's just favorites, and it's been like six days, six days, it's past July, it's past my July 3rd, so I'm kind of late. Sorry, so um, let's just get right into the favorites because I'm kind of hungry. So first, the w first favorite is a palette from Bath and Diary Mark. It's the Warm Vanilla Sugar Fragrance Mist. I got this for Valentine's Day, but I never got a chance to use the fragrance mist, but I did get a chance to use the other Bath Body Work stuff that came in the Warm Vanilla Sugar set. Smells so good. It's a nice vanilla smell. And I would really have like a candle in my room that smells like this. It smells amazing. And it's three fluid ounces, so it's pretty big for perfume. This is a pretty big bottle, because you don't need a big bottle of perfume. This lasts a really long time. I'm not sure how much one of these fragrance bottles cost. I'm not sure if it says on the bottle. Oh, six dollars. This is six dollars. This, this fragrance mess is six dollars. Yeah, if you're wondering. I'm pretty sure. Next one is a hand cream, something I love to use on my hands every day. I just used it today for when I was gathering up my stuff for the favorites video. The Citrus Mint Hair Cream from Lord Grace Company. Not familiar with the company, but my sister, my big sister, Vicky gave it to me because she didn't want it. She didn't like it. I don't really like hand cream, but I liked it. And it's citrus mint, and it smells so good. And it really makes my hands soft after I use it. It really like makes them very soft and nice. It smells so good. It all the instructions it gives you to massage onto hands and to absorb, keep skin silky, soft, and nourish. Use only as directed. So I do. You do the same thing you said in the bottle, just massage it into my hands. Maybe I can demonstrate that. It smells so good. I just took off because you can touch it because I already used it today. Don't really need it. So what you do is just massage the cream into your hands. Massage it. And it I'll just use a little because Sometimes when I use too, one time I used too much, and it took forever to massage it to my hair. So I let it massage, and it and then leave your hair smelling really good, citrusy and minty. A really good combo of citrus and mint. So I'm just gonna close the back up, pull it back. My hands are gonna be extra soft today because I use. Oh, it makes your hands so soft. Okay. Favorite the Never Bath and Body Works product because. Who doesn't like Bath and Body Works? It's the Cherry Burlap Hand Soap for Bath and Body Works. This is something my sister Vicky purchased. Big sister Vicky purchased. And I'm not sure how much this costs for a big bottle. I don't know if she got it for buy or get one free or anything, so I'm not really sure of the price because there's no tag, no, there's no price on it, or tag, or whatever. And it smells really good. I smells like cherries. I love cherries. Like, I like, I don't like the real cherries, but I like, like, cherry flavored stuff. So, it's the scent of cherries, so it smells really good. So I use, we use it in our upstairs bathroom, not that bathroom. And I use it all the time in the bathroom, because it smells amazing. My next favorite is a product for Lush, because I'm pretty much obsessed with Lush. Because I did try to film some Lush hauls for you guys, but they never, they failed to upload on the you on my webcam on the computer. So I couldn't share that with you guys, but I have purchased products from Lush. And this is the Twilight Shower Gel from Lush, and it's really nice. It smells exactly like the Twilight Bath Bomb, because I have smelled it in the Lush store. And it smells really good. Actually, my mom said she let me use it. it. Smells so good. It smells exactly like the Twilight Bath Bomb. Cause I can smell this all day. I went through like candle. It smells like this. It smells so good. And this product was passed by Susan. See, a lady named Susan. So thank you for packing this nice product. And it says on it, recreate the magical moment. 
between day and night with the sparkly, exuding lavender and tonka gel, perfect for calming kids and adults on Christmas Eve. And this is 3.3 fluid ounces, and that makes 100 milliliters, and it's also vegan. So it's a lot of shower gel, and this lasts about more than two months, so that's really good. Then my next favorite is, of course, chapstick. Ooh, I dropped my soap. Is a chapstick? And I'm not sure what brand this from. I'm not sure. I got it at the grocery store, so I don't. I just picked it up, threw it into the cart without my mom knowing because, you know, I do that sometimes. This is just classic strawberry chapstick to keep my lip, my lips from not getting chopped, especially in the summer. Your lips can get very chopped, so you want to prevent that, especially. So it's good to carry about chapstick with you. I do carry around an ELS lip balm. In my Hello Kitty purse, if you can see somewhere down there by the bathroom, hanging up on the closet door. And I just keep an EOS in there because in case I want to reapply, because chapstick is really important. And this one smells really good. I like the smell of strawberry, but I don't like the taste of strawberry. I don't like the taste of any fruit in general. Next, for a plushie. Last month, my favorite plush was the dragon, but now. Who cares about that dragon? This much, I've been loving Sadness and Robert. I love the movie Inside Out. It was a great movie. I did see it the last month in the month of June. It was, a, it was so amazing. You guys should definitely see it. Why still in theaters? Or you don't get a chance to see it. After it gets out of the theaters, at one point this month, um, you should, you should go get it on DVD. I had like a brain, like a brain fart for a second. I did not know what was happening. <laughs> so yeah, so go see that movie. It's amazing. Kids out there, if you're watching it, go see the movie. Well, this, I got this from the Disney store for $14.95, so that's a pretty good price I cut. She's a very huggable animal. Got a little broken here. Hair flops. I'm just gonna have my grandma sew that back on. And she's so cute. I love to cuddle her like when I go sleepy. And I also have the sadness plush. Tube Soup, because I love Soup Soups. And Tube Soup. Soup Soup. And it's just, this is five ninety five. So if you want, if you like smaller toys versus a big plushie, I would suggest getting this, but I did. Now they're twins. I wanted twins. And I love soup suits, so that's why I got them. I love that. Now let's move on to something. So, on July 10th, the big new movie's coming out, so I just wanted to show you guys the book that I like to read sometimes. I'm not sure I read it this month, the month of June. I probably read it at least once in the month of June. I love Minions. I just wanted to show you this book because I did want to bring down my Minion and Evil Minion the animals I have upstairs. So it's just easier to show the book. And I might actually show this book in a video. Just Minion Official Minion Guide is a bunch of pages about Minions that I read it like a million times. Okay, now I gotta reach. I'm gonna do this one last. Reach. This is a fact favorite the Jet Pup. Mallow bites from the brand Kraft, and they're like cr crunchy marshmallows, and they're vanilla flavored. And I, my sister Jessica loves to have them in hot chocolate. I love to take a bunch in my hand and throw it in my mouth and eat it. <laughs> oh, I gotta reach to get another one. I love graham crackers. My favorite is the honey made graham crackers, and they're actually funny. Honey made. Honey flavored graham crackers. The brand is Honey Made, I guess, or the name of the graham crackers. I don't know. And it's honey. I love. I don't like regular graham crackers. I only eat honey graham crackers because I don't think that the regular graham crackers have any flavor. So these are delicious. I love making s'mores. I like on the stove top and just eating these on a snack. And my family does too. But now let's go on to my last favorite. It's another it's something I've been obsessed with all month, and my family knows I'm obsessed. Because they say, why is Tom being so obsessed with Lush? It's 
splash. Splash fresh hair, many comments. Favorite story this month. Everything's everything is so fresh, naked, and most of the products are vegan. And all the products are definitely vegetarian. And they're fighting animal testing and human testing. So that's great. I love their bath bombs and bubble bars. And cherry gels. So everything at the store, I wish I could buy everything. So right now, I have no bath. I only have one bath on it. That's the telephone. The phone is ringing. So I have, right now, I have one bath bomb. It's a cute little lush bag. And it's just... Just a big blue bath bomb. So yeah. And I have some... Oh, I can't get that bomb in my mouth. No, 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 no. Here go. I think I got that bomb just in my mouth. Ooh, that's not a good idea. Don't get that bomb just in your mouth. That's like disgusting. <coughs> so, yeah. Thank you. So, that's my favorite video for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Comment down below, nice comments, or question of the day, is what's your favorite for June? Bye! Bye for your friend of the day! Aunt Teddy, Aunt Teddy, Aunt Teddy, and the candle holder, and all my favorites! You can't sing off my pantry. Oh, oh, oh. Bye!